Rising Power Up. Red took the first one, and Blue is looking to go into three. Cheesy Poops grabbed the scale, and 930 Graybots grabbed the switch for the Red Alliance. That's two power cubes from Red Alliance on the scale. And on the Blue Alliance, they've grabbed the switch. That's from Bot Provoking on the Blue Alliance side. They've grabbed the switch during the autonomous sequence. Red Alliance has that lead from doubling up during the auto run sequence. 254 gets a fourth one up there. That's Cheesy Poops with a fourth power cube on the red side of that scale. 4904 on the Blue Alliance. They're trying to grab that one more power cube. Hopefully get it up there on the scale, but Cheesy Poops have cube number five already up there on the Red Alliance side scale. And the Gray Bots are going for another one. Thunder down under, trying to push 254 out of the way. It looks like they're going to get them off to the side, trying to keep them away. 254 did toss a power cube into the scale on the Blue Alliance side to prevent them from scoring anymore on the Blue Alliance, but Thunder Down Under is successfully pushing 254, playing some aggressive defense and getting it out of the way. But 254 has got a second power cube in there, follows trade off by Thunder Down Under, and a third one from 254 going to prevent Blue Alliance from earning any additional points as they take over that switch on the Blue Alliance side. On the Red Alliance, we have 2367. Have Lancer Robotics have been loading up power cubes into the scale side, the uh, exchange zone for the Red Alliance. And Thunder Down Under really working to prevent 254 from continuing that scoring run. 254 blocking the way, but they drop another power cube in there. Some multiple defense. Thunder Down Under really trying to prevent that scoring from happening. Meanwhile, on the Blue Alliance, their partners spot provoking, trying to get one more power cube in there and perhaps get that Blue Alliance switch balanced back in the blue direction. Thunder Down Under pushing 254 back out of the way. Trying to prevent them from getting back in there and allow their alliance partner, Bob Provoking, having it to have a chance of getting that switch scored back in their direction. Red Alliance now plays the boosting power up, doubling up the point scoring for the Red Alliance currently in that time. 30 seconds remain now. It's been a bumper bumping match, and the Red Alliance is leading up, approaching the 400 point mark. Red Alliance has played the boosting power up, actually, they played the levitate power up as well. That earned them 30 points there in the last 30 seconds, and it looks like they're going to have Lancer Robotics use their forklift to climb again. Lancer Robotics trying to make their way up onto that platform. Meanwhile, Thunder Down Under, they're hooking on themselves, trying to get that 30 point bonus. They've got their forklift deployed, but their alliance partner is not there. Both alliances raise up independently. And looks like Red Alliance may have had two climbing robots. The referees will confirm. And the Blue Alliance had one at the end of quarterfinal number five. We do have those official scores. It was the Red Alliance winning the second match of quarterfinal number one. Red Alliance with a score of 499 and Blue Alliance with a score of 99. Red Alliance won their second.